Okay, what I want to show here is the levitating or the shooting aluminum ring off of a metal rod with a, a, a coil of wire energized by an AC current. Uh, if you can see, just got a six way, got my transformer, trans or microwave transformer, hooked directly up to the six way as usual with my switch on it. And from the transformer, the wires go into this coil here I've made, this green coil, which this is my stopper, which it just lets the aluminum ring only go down so far so that the magnetic field will shoot it up. If you go down here, the field pulls it down when it goes back and forth, up and down, up and down, like I told you. But on the upstroke, it'll shoot it off there. But if you get below that with this, it don't, it can't go all the way up because of the time. 60 cycles a second, don't have time to do it. Anyway, I'm showing here how this demonstration you might have seen on YouTube or wherever you can buy these, how it works. The uh, AC, as I showed before, goes through the primary coil of the transformer and it also makes a secondary coil do the north-south, north-south AC cycle which makes this green coil around here do the same thing but a lower voltage yet. Uh, the, the primary and the coil is 120, 60 hertz out of the plug-in, then the secondary coil drops that down, I'm not sure of the voltage and the amperage, then this coil drops it down again. But what I want to show is that the magnetic field put out by this coil here will shoot the ring. And everything's on, I'm going to turn the six-way on, you'll see the ring shoot up. So it shoots it completely off there. So it's, if you've watched them on YouTube, you'll see it. So here's a smaller ring. It's not near as thick. The first ring was that thick. This one's way smaller, about a third the size. I'll put it on there, and you'll see the, basically the same result with a little different power. And it actually hooked back on. Ha <laughs> I'll do it again. Maybe it'll fly off this time. So it flew off. And I'll try one that's even thicker than the first one real heavy ring and notice what it does it's just heavy enough to do that and the last trick is to turn it on and then put the ring on it and it'll levitate the aluminum over the metal rod it just levitates there if I leave it on too long my coil gets too hot here I need a quick switch but anyway showing how the magnetic field works electromagnetic field off an AC you can use a DC too to shoot it one way but I don't have enough DC power and when I hook my bridge rectifier up to this it's just not got enough power out of that winding to do it but the AC works pretty good but it will shoot aluminum rings off of the coil here we go again Anyway, I wanted to show you that, which is just another way to show how current coming through something, like we all know, but as the current goes around this and puts an electric magnetic field, also magnetizes this metal rod, it forces the aluminum to go up because it gets caught up in the acceleration. But my point on all this is, which I'm going to show in my next video, it's all accelerated gravity. There's no positive ions and negative ions. I'm going to explain that in my next video.